Uh, here we are at Miata's at the Gap 2021. Last year, they didn't have it because of COVID. This is actually a 25th year. We're at Fontana. This is usually where all the Miatas meet up. Basically, Miata's just take this place over. It's pretty cool. This is our sixth year coming. We have a good time doing it. We're actually gonna go up to the vendor station. I wanna buy some random shit. Looking for something rare. I never really buy anything, so this year I told myself I was gonna buy something. It's a cool car. Basically, there's so many cool Miatas. You know, you really see like the community come together. It's really cool, you know? Pretty cool car. Look at his seats. Right there, that's where they get all the pictures of the Miatas. They try to get all the Miatas to come together and get like one picture. And then they get a drone up in the air and get pictures of them. Hey, there's my wing, except it's in better shape. I have the same wing on my car, except mine's falling apart. Here's something interesting. This thing's pretty sick. Look at that wang, man. Like probably adds a crap ton of downforce. So this is the whole vendors area. Here's Spinny Woosh Graphics. We ran into him the other day on the Dragon. He makes a lot of vinyls. He's been doing it for seven years. His car is really, really cool. He's got a target top, fastback. Like, that's pretty much one of a kind. What's up, man? Good to see you again. Is this the other car you were talking about? Yeah, that's yeah, fine. I like it. Where's your turbocharger? Uh, in the mail. <laughs> Aha! Is it really? Ah, uh, it's it's on layaway, I guess. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> the car is like so loud, and then the engine bay is like stopped. Yeah. But that's okay. This thing's sick, man. I like it. I need to find Alex Todd because apparently he brought a whole bunch of stuff from from Japan. Well, I want those like European seats. I can already tell that they're not here though. They're uh, they're the Euro NB1 seats with the adjustable headrest, and I just think they look cool. Hey, if you want a Mazda speed bottom, there's your chance. Yeah, it's right there. There's a whole bunch of NB2 front bumpers. We could refinish. These are Euro ones. I mean, if we were refinishing it, we could you could fix that. Yeah, you could fix it, but. Yeah, but there are a couple Mazda Speed uh, 
This is Alex's tent here, uh, SMS. Yeah. What is it? Part? Yeah. So, he brought a lot of cool shit. He's always got a lot of cool stuff. I was looking for the European seats with the adjustable headrest, you know, the MB1 seats. And I looked, you don't have any. We didn't get some. And I, they're hard to find. We got another container company, maybe they Right on. I just think they're cool because of the headrest. We got a whole car with the headrest. We'll show you the whole car. <laughs> <laughs> right here, drive. <right. laughs> How much are these? 150 each? Because that's what they go for on eBay. Probably. That fits any of them, doesn't it? Yep. Sure does. It's fun. Yeah. Yeah, I would buy the gray one too for her car. It would look good. Yeah. Looking at all these shift knobs. Got to buy something. like while you're here I never buy anything I'm like that guy you know I always look at everything I don't buy anything this year I was like screw it I just think the MB2 front ends look amazing so came over to Alex Todd uh, we got a Mazda Speed front valence which I just think they look amazing and then we got a European MB2 front bumper we're gonna have to fill some holes we're gonna actually have a video and refinishing this whole thing it's gonna transform the front of my car it's been something that's been needed to be done for a long time I'm really excited about it uh, the only downside is is now I have to drive these windy roads with this big giant bumper in my car but we'll make it work Semi-autos are impractical. Nobody. Because check this out. Who needs F-150? Uh, fits perfect. Yeah, who needs a truck when you got a Miata, right? Oh, seatbelt, that is a good idea. <laughs> I got my uh, my baby boy strapped in. You okay, baby? Oh, you're so cute. Yeah, we're just gonna fix you up and make you the cutest. I just wanna hug you and love you and kiss you. Oh, okay. <laughs>